So we're looking at the following series, 1 to infinity of negative 1 to the k times ln of k over k. And we're going to determine first whether or not it's convergent. And then second, is it absolutely convergent or conditionally convergent, assuming it's convergent. So first part, A, let's see if it's convergent. Well, what we have is an alternating series. We have an alternating piece here. These terms will always be positive. So that means we just need to look at the limit as k goes to infinity of ln of k over k. Now, this goes to infinity and this goes to infinity, so we have an infinity over infinity case. So using L'Hopital's rule, we're going to take the derivative and recalculate the limit. Well, the derivative of 1 over k, or excuse me, the derivative of ln of k is 1 over k. Derivative of k is just 1, so 1 over k over 1, I'm just going to leave as 1 over k, which equals 0. So we know this series is convergent by the absolute value test, or excuse me, alternating series test. Now let's see if it's absolutely convergent. So what we need to do is we need to test the absolute value of this series. So negative 1 to the k ln of k over k. Now this is the only part that makes the terms negative, so taking the absolute value makes this equal to k equals 1 to infinity of ln of k over k. So this is the series we need to test for convergence or divergence. So in looking at to test this one, one thing I'll notice is that ln of k is greater than 1 for k values greater than 3. Now I know we're doing from 1 to infinity, but what we care about is the end behavior. So I can separate to a partial sum from 1 to 2 and then from 3 to infinity and see what happens from the 3 to infinity part. And I'll, I'll do that in my conclusion so you can see what I mean. Well, divide both of these by k. So ln of k over k is greater than 1 over k as long as k is greater than 3. And we know that the series 1 over k is our harmonic series it diverges, so our series ln of k over k, now we're just doing from k equals 3 to infinity, diverges. Now here's what, what, what we're doing. We were trying to test k equals 1 to infinity of ln of k over k, and what we're doing is we're splitting it into k equals 1 to 2 of ln of k over k plus k equals 3 to infinity of ln of k over k. We know this piece diverges. We just showed that. Well, if this diverges, the sum diverges. That means this guy here diverges. So, this is not absolutely convergent, it is conditionally convergent. And sometimes this is what we'll do, we'll split a series because all we really care about is its end behavior.